Moby was kind of made to help other students necessarily um, do real world stuff outside of school. Uh, so a big problem that a lot of um, startups or big companies face is once they get a student, uh, a lot of times they might not know much compared to what they're already doing. Uh, and at school anyways, they kind of teach basic, you know, Java, um, basic engineering stuff that may not apply as much on the outside world because, you know, it's already built. So the real world flow is completely different almost in a sense. So that's what we're trying to help anyways. So we have two types of meetings. The first one's Moby Learn, which is where we kind of go out and teach iOS, Android, hybrid apps, pretty much anything real world, web related, app related whatsoever. And then we finally have the social coding, which is essentially we could just kind of get together and build apps together. Uh, so right now we're working on one called UTA Now. It's all the events on campus. It gets into Mavorgs, Facebook, Google, all that kind of stuff. And all these little side projects are just fun projects for us. Uh, we've also built a few things as a group anyways, entered in a few hackathons. One of those, UTA Radio, we actually made the Android app for UTA Radio. Uh, we made them a live analytics feed so they can say upvote and downvote of kind of whether someone likes a song or whether they don't like a song. Uh, UTA Now, we just talked about that, design completely changed. Uh, so this is Campus Synergy. We went to a hackathon in Austin. Uh, we actually ended up with fourth, but uh, it's essentially UTA Now. It was the original idea before UTA Now existed. Just kind of um, placing events around campus, getting students more interested in clubs and other organizational events.